I'm Dr. Carrie Seal, and this is Ivy League. We've gathered some of the top expert doctors and surgeons in their field to come together and tackle some of the most unique and complex problems in modern medicine today. David is an exceptionally athletic person who over the course of time has accumulated a lot of accidents ranging from bicycles to motorcycles. I've broken my left ankle, my right ankle twice, my kneecap, both arms, all of my ribs, my ACL has been torn. There's a problem in my hip that I can't pronounce. Migraines, a line drive baseball to the face. Both of my shoulders routinely fall out of their sockets. <laughs> you, you name it, I've, I've had it. In July of 2010, I was riding my motorcycle and ended up running right into a car I thought that I was going to die. My knee and my hip have gotten to the point where they've seriously affected my life. Not having great vision is playing a part in me getting injured. The chronic pain that Dave experiences prevents him from exercising or even enjoying his quiet time. And because he had had multiple surgeries previously that had failed, Justin Salomon was the right orthopedic surgeon to solve David's problems. So what do you think of Dave? He has a couple of big problems ahead of him. He has a meniscus tear that's in a very difficult to see place within the joint, very far in the back. You think you can get to it? Yeah, and I think I have a way to sew it together that it's gonna work. I invented the device that enables you to surround the tear, repairs the bottom of the tear and the top of the tear at the same time. Minimally invasive, go home the same day. It sounds like his hip is gonna need more work. Yeah, so this hip surgery is relatively new. Go in with a camera, using a burl, you can reshape the hip so that it no longer hits when they move. So it sounds, Justin, like we have a game plan. He'll come in and have his LASIK done. You're gonna do his knee and hip at the same time. Yeah, I think we can get him back to a high level of function. Self-proclaimed walking disaster day. Met with some of our Ivy League team members. They came up with a blueprint to put him back together. Let's see what happened in the OR. Hi, Dave. How are you? Good. We'll be going into surgery in a few moments. I can't promise that the LASIK will get rid of the migraines. I can pretty much promise that he'll get rid of the glasses. Look down towards your toes. Both eyes open. Look right at that light. Things will start out blurry. And by the time I'm done, you can tell that things are getting more clear because that light will become more clear later. Beautiful, I love it. So now we can say you were perfect in both eyes. So with Dave today, we're gonna to do two procedures. We'll start on his hip, and then we'll move to his knee. So through two poke holes, I'm actually taking down the socket. Uh, he has an overgrown socket, and the next step is to go reshape the ball. I sewed the labrum back on. You can see one here, one here, and one here. So we're finishing up on the hip and we're gonna to move to the knee now. All right, so the art scope's in the knee. He has some, some uh, damage underneath his kneecap here, but I'm thinking that his tear is in the medial meniscus. It is so far back, it's hard to see back there, but my probe just fell into it. It's clearly torn back here. So this is the Soterix Novo Stitch device, and it's designed to sneak into the back of the knee. And these are the main stitches here, these three stitches is for holding that meniscus back together while it heals. So I'm all finished up, and now we're gonna to head to the recovery room. 